how to use this SMD rework station. This is uh, the machine to remove the SMD components. Okay, so first of all, you have to start. Start then air also. You have to give fast to one or zero. Then on. Then what you have to do? First of all, you have to adjust the air at least two for the heater also. At least two. Okay. Don't give that much air or that much heater. Okay. So you have to check from here. Check here. Okay. So what I'll do is that. First of all, I'm going to remove first. I'll try this component also. Okay. Whether I can remove or not from that SMD also. There is a technique to remove this component also. So what you have to do is that apply some paste here. Apply here. Here. Focus here. Don't give close. Okay. If you give that much close, it'll get damaged there the circuit. So you don't give that much close. So done. Yeah. So what you do? You can use a soldering pump. Or you can use with the tweezer or something. So here you already know yesterday that this part is minus and this part is plus. Okay. So here like this. Push. And now I'll use the same technique. This one with a soldering wire. So check it's done it's working okay so but uh, okay clear so if this is too much so you can take the excess one using a desoldering wire I'm sure desoldering where is desoldering wire desoldering wire you can use with this is called desoldering wire okay if that is too much you can use that one this something so now i'm going to remove the component that give one motherboard i'm going to remove this component i'm going to remove this smd component to remove this one whether I do from top or from bottom also that is according to your technique 
Okay, good. So, I'll use this one. See, first of all, if you're going to take out any component, first of all, you check. See here, here the pin, here is some. First of all, what you do is that you have to check the pin. Okay. So this level is up this side, this level. Okay, everything is like this up. Okay. But this is this. So what you have to do is that this you have to fix exactly. Where whatever you take out from here, you fix the exact position. Otherwise, you fix by reverse and get damage. Clear. So written this written here is this way. So I have to fix that way. <coughs> okay. So what I'll do is that apply some. So you have to hold with it together. Okay. So and next thing is that what you have to do is if that component is damaged so you have to note down the level of this one okay the number of this one you have to note down the number then you can buy from the market and you can fix it back clear so same thing now i'm going to fix this one fix this one also same thing here written this this side okay you should remember otherwise then if you fix reverse like this, it'll get damaged. So you should remember <coughs> first. So like this. So what you have to do? Hold with tweezer. Adjust the pin level. Done. Just fix now. Fix. So, so what you'll do is that clean with this PCB cleaner to clean all this uh, flux. Okay, this piece is with this PCB. This okay. Just by doing that like this, also your motherboard will work. Clear. 90% chances of working. So how to off this one? So off this one, first of all you load the uh, give the heater to number one, then this one air to number eight. After that, press on off. Automatically this will off. So you just wait because heat is still there, it will on like that. Just check that.
Oke. Okay. Dah.